Happy Friday, everybody. I was just in meditation. I was floating around the multiverse. Um, I was in different rooms, and every room had uh, something else in it, right? You never know what is every room in the mind is something else, and it, it represents something else, it's some other compartment that you have in your mind, right? Yeah. <laughs> Like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. <laughs> so today, you know, you, you're always, everyone's on a, a little thing, a self-discovery. And it's always like every interaction that I have with a person, that, um, if you stay in a meditative state, you always end up providing something for that person that they need, right? Is that, You don't have any preconceived thoughts. I don't have any hidden agendas. And so that's something that... Um, try to think about in your own life don't have any hidden agendas just think when you're having an interaction with somebody stay meditative and then um you'll you'll naturally feed what that person needs and it happens to me over and over and over so um we're gonna see what you guys need right i mean we might as well just draw cards it's friday so let's draw cards not even ready to draw cards right the overall sense is the energy is kind of heavy but it's kind of it's slowly turning into something a little more light that's what i feel right i was meditating on all the continents earlier today and every place on the earth has kind of a different energy if that makes sense it's like rooms in the mind as you're dealing with a you know, it's just a large biofield of energy. And so everything is different, right? So there's all these different, there's different lights and then there's different blockages. Uh, Russia to me looks like a mostly kind of a, a very blocked off portion with very bright, shiny lights in the middle of it. Uh, it's like they're everything is shining from the inside out, right? So there's always a color spectrum of every place. And then there's um, different lights, different bright lights inside those color spectrums that are trying to illuminate what's going on there. So everybody's trying to provide something for each other. But if you're feeding off each other too much, then you're not... Um, really providing for each other in that sense. So everyone's making a different uh, access to source. You're not really accessing source if you're feeding off of your environment too much. So a lot of time to take reflection. New beginnings in our emotional spheres, right? You're letting go of old things, taking time to heal, thinking of the past, start building something new. Healing, thinking of the past, building something new. That's all we're doing, right? Starting over. Mother Earth let go and cosmic connection. Let's look at this building card a little more. What are we building? What are we building? Taking a time out. Getting connected, right? So make sure you're in, if you're healing, 
take a time out, get connected, go back to a lake like this, right? A nice, beautiful lake. This is uh, where uh, we've got a place in Idaho. People love this lake. It's like my favorite, one of my favorite places on the planet. Uh, we've offered to cut down some of these like um, dead trees. You can see that there's a dead tree there, but there's also an osprey nest in the top of it. So you got to be careful which trees you cut down. But um, the pine trees there, you know, I've got bug problems. And so the bugs start eating the trees. But uh, besides that, the overall message is take a time out. Think about which direction you want to go and get connected so that you can ground that later. And then I love to talk to any of you guys. If you guys ever want to reach out to me, I can usually point you in the direction where it feels like uh, you might have an energetic blockage. Uh, that seems like what I do, right? Is feel your energetic blockage and say, hey, look, just do that. Most of the time it has a lot to do with self-worth. So this is a subject that I was gonna talk about today. Um, don't associate your self-worth with anything in the physical, right? Think about what you, how you, what you do for other people. And if you're too constricted and you're, you're too bound up in fear or uh, bound up in any kind of mindset of I can't do this or I can't do that, um, that's going to reflect on your own self-worth, right? Any, any words that you use that say I can't is going to lower your, all, your own self-worth and it's going to block yourself energetically from maybe your love life or you know, how much money you're making. It doesn't matter, you know, materialism is just a thing, right? But your own self-worth is everything and how you view your own divinity, you know, your own ability to create the world that you're living in, right? You're, all of us are creating our own reality. And so if you feel restricted in any way, it's like, try to find, okay, why is that? Why do I view myself as being restricted? Why can't I create that thing that I want? and create the desires I want in this reality. Love you guys. Take time out, heal, and redirect.